is Ryan Eschenberg with the Lone Star Conference. I'm here with head soccer coach John Smith. What is your general excitement of now being in the Lone Star Conference? Um, there's, a, there's a nice buzz around uh, around the team. This is uh, obviously we've played all these teams uh, every year that I've been here, but uh, there's an extra significance in each game now when we're playing against the likes of Midwestern and West Texas because we're obviously trying to win a Lone Star uh, championship as well as a trying to make uh, national playoffs. So it's, uh, there's, a, there's a lot of excitement. This is a fantastic conference and we're just uh, pretty honored to be part of it. And like you've said, you've played many of the schools or pretty much all the schools in the Lone Star Conference. But now uh, two of your biggest rivals before Midwestern State and West Texas are now conference games. Do you think that those two games during the regular season will mean even more for you guys? Absolutely. I mean. Uh, I think uh, you know uh, everybody has a good idea that whichever team wins the the Lone Star Conference is going to be a, a, a national contender. You know, it's uh, it's one of those things where uh, before we play those games now, we what we want to win this conference, um, uh, just like every team in it. Um, uh, we, we addressed that on Friday against before we played Midwestern, and unfortunately we didn't come out uh, uh, with a, with a good result. But uh, yeah, it's got extra significance, uh, uh, and it's fun. This is a new challenge for us, you know. Having been in the Heartland, this is uh, uh, from a soccer standpoint, it, this is a tough conference, and so we're excited to be in it. Every game is going to be a battle, and uh, you know we, we feel uh, we're up for the challenge. And outside the Lone Star Conference, you started off the season with. Uh, five road games in a row, as well as uh, a road trip to Florida where you knocked off two top ten teams. Uh, was the team pretty excited off to the great start you got? I, I mean, if somebody had asked me before the season uh, that uh, would you have taken a 4-1 uh, record uh, after your first five games, considering three of those games would have been against teams ranked in the top ten when we played them, I would have snatched their hands off. I mean, it's. Uh, Tough, uh, it's a tough start to the season, five road games, and, and, but uh, it was a lovely trip to Florida. Um, played my former school and uh, then played Tampa. And great start. Uh, and uh, it's, it's been a tough opening five games, but uh, hopefully uh, the, the, the idea is that that experience really does stand us in good stead for, for the rest of the season because um, we now know the kind of caliber uh, and level of play we need to be at to, to be sniffing around at the end of the year. And uh, finally, what would it mean to you to win uh, the Lone Star Championship in your first year? I would love to win my Lone, uh, Lone Star Championship in my first year. It's, uh, um, I think I'm now beginning to realize that how good of a conference it is uh, just because all the finer details just to, you know the, in terms of getting emails and just wearing the Lone Star Conference emblem on the shirt it's so much more serious and uh, than, than it has been before and uh, uh, we'd all love it because I think we know that uh, any team that's good enough to win this conference is good enough to be a national contender and good enough to be playing in the final four come that first week in, the, in December. Alrighty well this has been Coach Smith with the Lone Star Conference Tune back tomorrow for more videos.